Hey there YouTube. How are we all doing this evening? Okay, I'm uh, back again tonight with a sauce review. A barbecue sauce review. Um, my friend Tim Bader from Volcanic Peppers. I was in contact with him and I ordered uh, a sauce from him. also ordered the shirt. And, well, the other day I was reaching into the refrigerator and uh, <laughs> pulling out my uh, bottles of hot sauce and whatnot. And while I've got so many bottles of hot sauce in the uh, refrigerator door on the shelf there that the, uh, the little metal strip that goes across the shelf broke... And all the sauces went tumbling. And my bottle of Lava Hot Scorpion Barbecue Sauce took the hit. And unfortunately, the cap broke. And the floor got to enjoy quite a bit of the sauce. I was able to save about two-thirds of the bottle, but very disappointed to say the least but anyway like I said I was in contact with uh, Tim Bader and you know let him know that I was doing videos and reviews and whatnot and, and I uh, asked for his permission to review this barbecue sauce and that I would wear my shirt during the video so yeah Lava hot scorpion barbecue sauce. I've already tried this. I am telling you right now that this is a delicious sauce. I loved it. So let me give you a rundown on the ingredients. Okay. Ketchup, molasses, brown sugar, apple cider vinegar, mustard, Okay, distilled vinegar, water, number one grade mustard seed, salt, turmeric, paprika, spice, natural flavors, and garlic powder, honey, smoked habanero, Trinidad scorpion, boot jalokia, maruga scorpion, salt, onion powder, garlic powder, black pepper, and cumin. And there is... 9 grams of sugar, uh, 11 total carbs, 200 milligrams of sodium, and believe it or not, there are uh, there's 4% of vitamin C, 2% calcium, 2% iron. Well, um, you can uh, find uh, Tim Bader on his uh, Facebook channel. You can also find him on YouTube. I will put uh, both those links in the description. There's also a little story over here on the other side of the bottle. Volcanic Peppers Hot Scorpion Lava is a rich, thick, and very spicy barbecue sauce. The heat comes from our custom pepper blend which includes smoked habanero, boot jalokia, which is the ghost, and both Trinidad and Maruga Scorpion peppers. Use it as a finishing sauce on your grilled meats to add some nice heat and flavor to your favorite dish or as a condiment for dipping. For a delicious snack, mix with meatballs, warm in a crock pot. Enjoy, Tim. Alright, so, like I said, Unfortunately, my cap broke. Let me see right there. Very disappointed, so I used a cupcake thingy to kind of keep the freshness in. And we got the trusty spoon. Unfortunately, I can't show you consistency, but it, it does have a very nice consistency. 
you can, uh, I think the, the uh, ketchup comes out a little bit. You can also smell the brown sugar and the garlic and the onion. Uh, and you can smell a little bit of the peppers, I believe. Really awesome, awesome, awesome smell. So, let's do a little uh, spoon test here real quick. Very nice looking sauce. Nice sweet. You can taste that brown sugar and that smoky flavor that you usually taste in a barbecue sauce. And uh, right away you get a, a nice all around even burn. I mean, hits the top of your tongue, just a little bit on the tip of the tongue, more towards the back of the throat. But I'm telling you folks, this is a a very good barbecue sauce. I love it. I've used it on quite a few things and uh, it's worth the money. Tim and I are both from the Midwest. He lives about, uh, well, Volcanic Peppers is a uh, Omaha based company and I live a uh, hundred miles north on Interstate 29 in Sioux City. So, one of these days I'm going to get down there to check it out. But anyway, here's a nice big spoonful. Nice smooth sauce. There's a few seeds in there, but not too carried away like I said great sweet flavor brown sugar and you can taste that smoke I want to say it's uh, you know like a liquid smoke taste you know wood smoke but then like I said right away them the peppers come through the the Maruga scorpion you know and the the boot jalokia I mean this it's not an over-the-top heat. I mean, it is warm, but very bearable for a chili head. For a non-chili head, this is probably going to be a little over-the-top. But uh, Wonderful, wonderful sauce. I, uh, I can't wait to try some of the other ones. I'm, I'm convinced that, you know, he has a great product. You know, this is... A great product and I'm sure the rest of them are just as good so um, on flavor I'm gonna give this uh, an eight and a half on heat um, I think I'll, I would I think I'd give it a, a seven and a half um, like I said, all around great barbecue sauce, good for finishing. You know, um, I've used it on steaks, uh, pork chops, pork loin. Oh, it's amazing on pork loin. Um, uh, chop steaks, you know, uh, hamburger steak, whatever you want to call it. But yeah, um, awesome. Uh, please like and subscribe, share, comment. And uh, I hope you all have a wonderful weekend. Take care.